guys, it's me, JC. I am back with another video. Today, we're gonna be talking about one of my favorite headphones. This is the Infinite Quiet X, and I have been using one of these since last year. So today, we're gonna check out what's inside the box when you get it. Let's check it out. What I got here is the white version. I also have, the, like I said earlier, I've been using the black one, but I wanted to show you guys what you actually get uh, when you unbox this thing. So let's go ahead and get something to open this. Oh, maybe I'm just gonna use my hand. I still don't have an unboxing knife. So yeah, before we go any further, I just wanna talk about uh, the elephant in the room. This is actually priced around $30 and I actually got this around $25 and it's actually a really good deal if you can get it at original price which is $30. So actually offers a lot for what it's worth. So first up, this is an over ear headphone so you got, you got all your ears covered, uh, external noise. But the thing that makes this stand out uh, compared to everything that you're gonna get below $30, even, even below $50, this thing has an active noise cancellation. So what is active noise cancellation? So normally when you get an earphone or headphones or headset, whatever you want to call them, but when you put them on your ear, you still hear a little bit of that external noise. But uh, with active noise cancellations, it's actually a really different story. So what active noise cancellation does is it picks up the noise from your external environment and then cancels it out with uh, pr by producing the opposite frequency. Actually, I always wear one of these on my commute. I don't hear the, the engine noise of the vehicle at the time. On to speed up with the talking, let's get right into it. So, okay, there goes the plastic. I really need... You're actually getting a lot here for $30, but I don't want to say anything. Let's just go inside the box. I'm quite cheating because I already unboxed one of these, but I wanted to share this experience with you guys. Well, first off, even though I unboxed one of these before, it was a black version, so it's actually kind of a different story with the white one. So out of the box, you get the headset itself. It actually looks really good. It's, it's not white, it's actually silver, I, I was wrong. And the air cushions are not white as well, so it's not gonna get as dirty as you might think. It's actually kind of like a uh, grayish something, light gray or something. So it really looks good, and and it's actually it actually feels really premium. Most the headband is mostly made out of plastic, but that's a good thing if you're using a headset, so it makes it really light. It has this. It's it's also padded so it doesn't hurt when you're wearing it. The air cups, the outside part, I think it's aluminum of some sort, or it's, but it's metal, I'm pretty sure it's metal. So if you can see right here, there's a hole. That's where the mic is. Now that mic is not for making calls, it's actually for picking up the external noise so it can produce those inverse frequency to cancel out the noise. So yeah, uh, let's put that on the side. First, let's take a look on what's inside the box. Another two box, so what's in there? The, you get a white aux cable, so, oh, I think I did not mention, this one is, this is a Bluetooth headset. Yes, Bluetooth headset with active noise cancellation for only $30. That's really cheap. The unboxing experience, this is what you get if you're gonna buy something around $200. I, I actually don't know how they make money by selling this at that price point, but hey, good for you, Infinix. That's, that's really a good deal. So you can use it uh, with wires if you run out of battery. And we have here the micro USB. Now, a lot of you guys might say, hey, it's 2019. Why are you still using a USB? This is not a USB Type-C, I'm sorry. This is, did I say USB Type-C? I don't remember. So this is a micro USB. Obviously it's for charging. So you might be wondering why it is not the micro USB that you guys probably have. Well, first of all, it's $30, below $30. You can't complain about that. And second of all, I think this was made around late 2017 or early 2018. So USB Type-C wasn't really that big back then, but it was around, it was around. Don't The other box has a pouch. This is a pouch. This is a, wow. This is this is uh, like an Alcantara texture. So it's really matte. I don't know if that's picking that up, but it's really matte. Wow, it looks so black in the camera. So let's just try it first in this case. Not most headphones offer this kind of package 
for most of them, even the ones above 100. So this one has carrying pouch, so you can put it in your bag and not worry about it getting scratched on your commute. That's what it looks like if in the pouch, so you can just, uh, here's my bag, you can just throw it in your bag and not worry about it getting scratched. So yeah, there's that. Anyway, let's go ahead and test this out. I'm gonna get my phone. Okay, I got my phone. It was outside. I was charging it outside. I don't know why I did that. So here's my phone. Okay, good news. It still has a charge in it, so we can test it out of the box. This thing uses Bluetooth aptX. What that does is it, it has a little to no latency, meaning if you were watching video, the audio is always on sync. Now, I don't know how that translates when you're playing games. If, hey, there's that. You can so I'm gonna open up Spotify. The buttons are also placed uh, on the best place you could possibly think. Uh, here's the play button, volume up, volume down. On the other side, you have, you can turn on, and pressing this once will turn on the active noise canceling and pressing it again will turn it off. Also, we have here the power button. Your thumb, when you're trying to press buttons when you're wearing headsets, it's right near the back, so it's placed in a way that you can press them easily when you're holding them. See? It's connected. Let's go ahead and play some music. So, so there's one thing here that I noticed. When you maximize your volume on your phone, that doesn't automatically mean that the volume here is max as well. You can press the volume buttons and it's still gonna go up. So it has a different volume setting than your phone. Just keep that. Now, since it has a play button, pressing it once, obviously, it's gonna play the music. Pressing it again, it's gonna pause. Now, obviously, we can't test the, uh, the active noise canceling. I mean, I can't test it. I can test it out, but I can't emulate it on how it actually sounds. How it's the actual experience is really different from ordinary head headphones. But I think I'm gonna try my best to emulate it, so I'm gonna do this in post. I'm gonna do this in post. Uh, for example, uh, okay. That is how it sounds with noise cancelling on and with noise cancelling off. That is how it sounds. With no music, that's what's gonna happen. Now obviously this differs from the environment. If, if, in, if you're outside with a lot of noise, it, it will still cancel some of those noise, but it will not cancel 100%. I think that's it for this video. Wait, it, it also matches with my laptop. Wait. Oh. So here's my laptop and here's the Infinite. Infinix Quiet X. It actually looks good together. It looks like they're made. Anyway, uh, I forgot. So here's what the black one looks like if you're also interested. It's full black. So the ear pods are black, the, the outside shell is black, and the headset and the, and the cushion right here is also black. So there's that. Here's the black version if you want to see that. There's that. Here's me wearing it. Here's what it looks like when you're wearing it. I just want to let you guys know that I'm really sorry for not uploading the whole month of January. I was really busy with a lot of things but hopefully I can get this back up. I have a lot of plans as well and you guys, thank you for the previous subscribers. Thank you guys for subscribing to my channel. I'll make sure to make more content. I'll try my best. I'll do my best to make more content that you guys might like. So anyway, again, thanks for watching. Peace.